Hello all, welcome to aurotrainings.com. In this session, we'll discuss about how do we create a wizard page in Oracle Apex. So let's see what is this wizard and how do we create it. A wizard type of page is a collection of pages in Oracle Apex. And it provides, you know, like uh, having the multiple set of pages which are provided in a sequence kind of fashion. Like, a, you know, like a, until unless you enter the master data, you cannot enter the child data. And whenever you need, you want to have this kind of control, a stepwise kind of data, you can just go with a wizard kind of uh, page. So let us try to create this particular application now. So I'll click on create. I'll just create a new app, wizard app demo. And now I'll just create a page and you can select the page type as wizard. And by default, it shows three steps, but you can increase the number of steps at later stage or now also you can do it. Now I'll say a wizard page and I'll just add one more step. And this is step number four. And I'll say step number four. Click on create wizard. So this process will create the four pages, okay? Now we can just click on application. You can see the four pages. Step one, two, three, and four, okay? So let's run the page. And here you can observe that, like uh, the blue color highlighted portion tells that this is a current page in which our screen is in. When you click on next, what will happen is this blue color of step one will become green and the blue color will get shifted to step two. And similarly, when you just click on next, once more it will go to step three and then the step three becomes blue. And when you click on next again, step three becomes green and step four becomes blue. Nothing but it shows that you're navigating, you're forwarding, you're progressing your page application process. And you know, like finally we reach the last step and that's how it shows the finish. And now here we don't, we have not added any business logic or data here, but actually the functionality here is you add the steps, you add the content here. And based on that, you want to control the functionality. Maybe, you know, like uh, what we can do is let's say, I'll just uh, go to the step one and you know we can add up some content here let's try to add one interactive uh, kind of a reporter grid let's say on the body i'll just click on create region and i'll just change this particular style to interactive grid and here i'll just enter the table as emp okay so now what i'm doing is at the step one at the step one i just added a interactive grid report for the emp table let's see how it works right so now what happened so at the step one I'm showing the EMP data. Let's say in the step two, you want to show one more data, just add one more region. In the step three, you want to add one more data, you can do that, that way. So it's not just adding up a region of only entry, like an entry, uh, what you call display purpose. You can add the normal data entry form also, right? Like rather than just showing the report, you can add a data entry form also. So this is all about a wizard functionality in Oracle Apex. Okay, thank you.